In this video, we'll be bringing together the four golden rules of keyword research. We'll also be taking a look at a real-world example, which will show you exactly how to use Market Samurai to find the best keywords to target in your online business. Just to reiterate, the four golden rules of keyword research are relevancy, traffic, competition, and commerciality. Finding the best keywords to target in your business involves a process of filtering. We start with a large number of keywords and initially we eliminate the keywords that are clearly not relevant to our online business. Then we apply a PBR relevancy filter to remove any misleading keywords. Next we apply a traffic filter to filter out the keywords that do not have sufficient levels of traffic. Then we analyse the amount and strength of the competition to filter out keywords that are too competitive. Finally, we apply a commerciality filter to eliminate the keywords that have little or no commercial value. The end result is that we are hopefully left with a set of gold nugget keywords. These keywords are relevant, have good levels of traffic, acceptable levels of competition, and a high level of commerciality. Let's now take a look at what this entire process looks like in the real world using Market Samurai. I'm going to start from scratch this time and explore the dog training market in detail. So the first thing I'll do is click the new project button and now I'll enter my seed keyword dog training. Next I'll click the keyword research button to access the keyword research module and to generate an initial list of keywords that are relevant to my seed keyword I'll just come over here and click the Generate Keywords button. Market Samurai goes out and gathers information which can take a few minutes. Now here is where I can quickly eliminate any keywords that are not relevant to my website. For the sake of this example I'll assume that I'm not interested in dog collars. So I'll just select the word collar and then come over here and click the cross icon to make it a negative keyword. And I also want to eliminate the word collars with an S. This time I'll just come over here and type it in and then click the update button. After eliminating any irrelevant keywords I then click the keyword analysis button. On the analysis screen I can select the Golden Rules preset from the Filter drop-down menu. This Golden Rules preset automatically applies the filters that I need to find my Gold Nugget keywords. This includes a Phrase to Broad Match filter to eliminate misleading keyword phrases and an SEO Traffic filter to filter out any keywords that do not have the potential to deliver at least 50 visitors to my website each day. Now the next thing I'll do is deselect the AdWords value and the Trends checkboxes as we don't need these right now. Then I'll click the Analyze Keywords button to obtain my competition and commerciality data. This can take a few minutes. And now that I've got my competition and commerciality data I can see that more of my keywords have been filtered out. This is because the Golden Rules filter also filters out keywords with high SEO competition and low SEOV or commerciality values. If you have an existing website with a good page rank and a strong link network, then you will be able to target keywords that have a higher level of competition. But for this example, I'll just stick with the default values. Finally, as you can see here, the Golden Rules filter has set the results to be sorted by values in the SEOV column as indicated by this triangle. So after generating my initial list of keywords, I've now filtered my results by relevance, traffic, competition and commerciality. As you can see in this example, I'm now left with a small list of only the most promising keyword phrases. Now this is where you do need to use a bit of intuition. What I'm looking for is whether there's any common thematic link that connects the keyword phrases that have made it through my filters. 
A good way to do this is to ask this question. If I was to develop a site based on the phrase X, how many of these other keywords would be relevant to that site? For example, let's look at the top keyword phrase here, dog training pads. If I was to develop a site based on the phrase dog training pads, how many of these other keywords would be relevant to that site? In this example, the answer is probably none. Let's look at the next example on my list. If I was to develop a site based on how to train my dog, how many of these other keywords would be relevant to that site? The answer in this case is quite a few. Dog training secret would be relevant, as would clicker training dogs. Aggressive dog training, clicker training for dogs, dog clicker training, and dog training reviews. So this time, I have a number of keyword phrases that are thematically related, which is a much better result. These are my gold nugget keywords. They are relevant, they have good levels of traffic, acceptable levels of competition, and high levels of commerciality. An effective way to construct a website using these gold nugget keywords is to select one of them as your main theme keyword, which becomes the primary focus of your website, and then use the other keywords as category keywords. For example, imagine that I decided to move ahead and create a dog training related website. Based on my data, I might choose how to train my dog as my main theme keyword, and then use my other keywords as category keywords as shown in this illustration. Within each of these categories, I would then write as many good quality articles as possible. The end result would be a content-rich website that specifically targets a set of thematically related keywords. Coming back to Marco Samurai, the next thing to do is to check the strength of the competition associated with the keyword that I'm thinking of using as my main theme keyword. To do this, I'll just click on this key icon and then come up to the top of the screen and click on the How to Train My Dog tab. Now I'll just select the SEO Competition module and click the Generate Results button. In assessing this SEO matrix, I can see that none of these websites has been completely optimised for the phrase How to Train My Dog, which is generally a good sign. Therefore, my gut feel when looking at this SEO matrix is that if I developed a great website with good quality articles targeting my theme and category keywords, I would have a reasonable chance of making it onto the front page of Google. So just to recap, in this video, we've seen that the four golden rules of keyword research provide you with a practical way to identify the best keywords to target in your online business. We started with a large number of keywords and then filtered them down by relevance, traffic, competition and finally commerciality. We then identified our gold nugget keywords and saw how these phrases can be used to develop a keyword optimised framework for our online business.